night time. Uh, we're going to have a little sleep. I put a door on the house, and otherwise, uh, I haven't done any real work. Um, for those of you that are just joining me, uh, my name is Matt, and I'm playing some uh, it's Minecraft Technic Pack. Today, what we're going to do is we're going to sit down, got some tin macerating off of a battery, which isn't ideal. This battery's empty. We had some sticky resin in there. It makes some rubber. Rubber makes copper cable. Um, you can use copper cable for any number of things. Uh, we, we're going to use them for uh, circuits, uh, electronic circuits. But the problem is that right now we're, we're running off of this generator. In order for the generator to run, you have to put wood in the bottom or coal or other, other forms of fuel. And we don't have a whole lot of coal primarily because I've used it mostly for torches. So, you can see we got uh, the tungsten. It's not very useful. Uh, let me sort this. No. No coal left. We're completely out of coal. And I've still got the, the rest of this stack of iron to macerate. This, this macerator is just going so slow. I know we can make an upgrade. Let's look what the upgrade takes. Overclocker upgrade. Oh! crap. Um, this takes some coolant, some copper cables, electric circuit, the coolant cell. I'm not really sure how you make a coolant cell. I'm pretty sure you make it out of uh, some tin, but we don't, we don't have enough tin. And on top of this, you know, we've got a macerator, we've got an extractor. All this takes electricity at the end of the day. And so I'm saying to myself, why don't we go and make something more efficient? Now, I've gone ahead and I've put together the ingredients necessary. Uh, and I'll show them to you. For what I think is a solar panel. So this is what a solar panel looks like here and we're going to build one of these. The problem is, there's all these trees up above us. And so there's an easy solution to these trees, and it doesn't involve cutting them down. And so, getting out old and trusty, and uh, actually we're going to sleep first, and I will start the video again once this is done sleeping. Alright, I'm back. Um, for whatever reason, the frame rate while I'm sleeping, just just drops so significantly. Oh god, there's a skeleton over there and he's wearing armor. Fortunately, he only has a sword, so I can kind of run up and... Oh, is he dodging me? That little cheeky little bastard. Oh, no, he wasn't dodging me. He just looked like he was dodging me. I don't even have any coal left for torches, so like I can't light that little bit up there. It's just so dark here. We, it, it's impossible to do anything. So we just we just need to get rid of these these trees, particularly these these big ones. I don't think this wood is good for anything, and even if it was, there's plenty of it. And even after I burn everything down, I already I just revealed my my secret plan. I'm burning everything down. I'm gonna use some uh, flint and steel, and I'm just gonna torch it all. Uh, these these trees are a nuisance. So starting over here. This, you see, this is this is why you're subscribed. If you subscribed, uh, I appreciate it, and I thank you for your. I don't. I guess you didn't really. Con oh no! Shit! Oh god! Oh, you see, this is bad karma. What I'm doing? Oh god! And there's a spider. Oh man! Oh, damn it! Oh, fuck! Get rid of all this shit that's in my inventory. Oh god! Oh, that's that scared the crap out of me. I guess I didn't pick up that thing over there. Um, where was I? All right, I was up there. Let's get back to where I was. My health is slowly regenerating. Fortunately, I have a little bit of health left. Oh, my pickaxe is broken though. See, that could be a problem. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go downstairs. Got to be prepared for this. This is a serious operation that I'm about to perform. I'll bring my tree tap with me when I come back. 
I'm concerned about my house. I know, well, maybe wooden stairs catch on fire. The wooden stairs used to not catch on fire, which was useful. Uh, it was a very good thing because you couldn't really fuck anything up. Like, if you, if you accidentally, if your house was catching on fire, whatever, you know, it's fine. You make do. Uh, since they've changed things, I'm not entirely sure. So I'm going to put my coal dust. I'm just going to put everything necessary for this solar panel into this chest so that it's, it's right there, easy to access. Inventory is nice and cleared out. Um, I think that's good. I'm going to make myself a pick, though. We do need a pick. Or not a pick, an axe. I always get axes and picks mixed up. Mostly because they both have axe in their name. Just gonna get this sticky resin so that uh, it can grow back. And as we're generating electricity, uh, we're gonna have a lot more capacity to extract some rubber from 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 the sticky resin. There's so many dogs in this too. Oh 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 oh! That was lucky. There's something underneath me. I almost... Ah, oh, yeah, there's that torch. So I'm just gonna kinda sneak down here. What a... Oh, God. Gotta watch that I don't accidentally sprint when I don't mean to. I'm gonna try and control this burn so that we're only getting trees that we want to chop down. We don't... We don't really want to... just nuke the whole forest because... You know, obviously we're trying to be pretty conservative. Conservative in the uh, in the sense of conservation and not right-wing nutcase. So, uh, in in the spirit of not being Rick Santorum, we're gonna we're gonna do this the right way. We're gonna back up a little bit. I mean, this wood only produces sticks. It can't really do a whole lot with that. Oh man, this is so satisfying. Oh, but I can't light this on fire. Can these... Can I... What? Why can't I... Oh, there we go. You can only light the top of, of this wood on fire, apparently. Oh, and it burned out. So I can't burn these trees down. Shit. Well, that was the most uneventful tree burning ceremony. It, you can see I'm right-clicking, and I'm, I'm not igniting anything. That's really frustrating. On the upside, it means that there's going to be a whole lot of extra wood left over. I realize you guys are probably incredibly disappointed. You know, I'm about to start a forest fire, which, frankly, could be an incredible source of entertainment. You know, everybody was ready to, to see this disaster rip out of control, out of my grasp. Is this a... There's got a sapling. Rubber tree... Rubber sapling. Got a little leaf there. Uh, an apple rather than a leaf. Leaves and apples are not the same thing. Uh, but right now I'm actually eating away at the wrong tree. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of try and make my way back over in the right direction. Oh, God. All right. Well, that, that didn't really work. Oh, fuck. Well, fortunately, there's this apple here. I'm just going to eat it, because why not? It's free food. I can't believe I can't burn these trees down. You know what? As long as I've got all this rubber wood on, on me, you know, handy, ready to go, I might as well just stick it all in here because I'm not doing anything with it, and I'll just charge up this bat box. And I'll stick a battery in it, so that there's a little more capacity. I can burn these saplings, too. Uh, saplings will burn. That's something that I learned. Interestingly enough, uh, saplings can be incredibly useful. Oh, thank God that stupid tap broke. I made like four of them because I forgot that I had one. And it's like, oh man, these things break all the time. It turns out they don't actually break all the time. And I, I was just making that part up. 
I guess to convince myself that I need to make more things, you know, stimulate the economy. You might say I'm not Rick Santorum, because I'm, you know, not a conservative. I don't try to insult creepers or, you know, any other denomination of people or non-people, for that matter. I don't, I don't go around uh, bad-mouthing testificates and telling them that they need to learn English. You know, I, I, w I would say with fair certainty that I'm not Rick Santorum. On the flip side, uh, I, I am going to kind of decimate this, this forest. Slowly but surely, I'm eating away at this, this rubber tree. It is a rubber tree. Rubber sapling. Uh, I guess it is. A, see, the thing is, the forestry mod introduces a bunch of trees, and then some of the other mods introduce a bunch of trees, and sometimes there's some overlap. Perhaps there's not too much overlap with the trees, but I know, like, you can get... There's, like, three different kinds of tin in this game. Like, who who, is, who said, oh, yeah, we should have, like, tin, and then we should have tin ingots, and then we should have tin bars? It, it's, it's just a mess. Maybe some of it's legacy stuff, where it's like, oh, this should have been phased out with an older version of the game. But frankly, like... I, if it were me, I would have just been like, let's cut our losses. Uh, I guess I guess you can't do that, can you? I think, more often than not, you, you can't really cut your losses. Like, at this point, you know, Rick Santorum has invested so much money that he just can't drop out of the race. You know, that would be like... That would be like if Bill Gates was like... Oh, I guess not Bill Gates anymore, but whoever's in charge at Microsoft. They just said, you know what? Windows is just it's just not working. We're just gonna we're just gonna stop making it now. Sorry everyone. You know, that's that's kind of the position that he's in. Nobody likes him. He's at this point basically just insulting people so that somebody says, you know what, it, you just can't you can't be elected. You can't run for president anymore. You're too offensive. You need to be on like HBO after eleven o'clock because Nobody really likes you, and you just you just keep bad mouthing people. Well, I guess now you guys know my political affiliations, namely being uh, don't vote for Rick Santorum because he's an asshat. That's really my only political belief. I actually made buttons. Uh, they say don't vote for Rick Santorum. He's an asshat, and you you can buy them. They're on Etsy. They're actually not on Etsy. I don't actually have buttons. But if, if I was, you know, so, so enthusiastic about politics that I, I was inclined to make buttons, I probably would go um, in the direction of anti-Rick Santorum. No other direction. I wouldn't be Democrat or Republican. I would be anti-Santorum. Oh man, we got so much wood now. Wood that, to the best of my knowledge, is only good for making sticks. So we'll just drop all that in there. This bat box is slowly filling up. I'm just going to swap this battery out. Uh, put more sticky resin in here so that it has something to work with while we're gone. I'm going to put this battery in the bat box. Let it charge up. If it manages to, ch I don't think it's going to charge all the way in the time that we're here. So we'll just let that go. See, this is... Oh, is that a creeper? Oh god, it's a creeper. See, this is, this is the danger of having those really big trees. We need another axe, though. It's like, it's like if the show Axemen had to be cancelled because... They ran out of. They ran out of axes, or like their chainsaws all ran out of. All ran out of power. By power, I mean gasoline. They they were just like, oh man, guys. What are the odds? We we forgot that we need to bring some. Some gasoline with us to put in the. To put in the chainsaws. You know that was that was really silly of us. 
So I, I, I have to make two things right now. The first thing I'm going to make is a an axe. The second thing I'm going to make actually is a chest. And um, this will be useful in a little bit. Basically for now I'm just going to toss the rest of this shit that I don't need into this box. I'm probably going to put half of that wood in there. Um, basically any kind of fuel that I intend to burn is going to go in that chest. As long as I'm walking through, I just see if there's yeah, here's some some of that. Oh man. So this is taking absolutely forever. You know, oh god, I almost fell there. The upshot is that again I'm gonna have so much fuel, I'm just not gonna know what to do with myself. And I'm gonna show you guys something pretty neat that we're gonna be able to do in order to kind of prevent us from having to work our asses off to make sure that that bat box... Oh god, I broke another pick. I'm just gonna make... I'm gonna make a crafting table up here and I'll just destroy it before I... bomb the whole thing out. Okay, so here's our axe. and I'm just going to keep chopping away. There's not too much left, fortunately. On this branch, at least, it seems like there's not that much. Um, it's The weird thing is that it's kind of tenderly. It's not like any tree that I've ever known. I think I hear an enderman up here, too. It's probably like right behind me, but everybody knows you should never look for an enderman. That's like a rule somewhere. Don't look for Enderman. Alright guys, so it's daytime. I've got most of the tree cut down. There's just a few little scraggly bits left, but I'll get those someday when I get the rest of the trees. Uh, over there, obviously, there's a lot with that tree, but there's sunlight here, and that's what matters. So what I'm going to do, and hopefully you guys like this, I'm going to build a bit of a tower. I'm going to build it out of cobblestone because I want to make a ladder up the side when I'm done. In fact, rather than <clears throat> rather than just uh, placing a tower in the middle of my little construction here, I'm gonna replace that bit of fence and make some ladders. I don't know if that'll be enough. That should be fine for now. We can make more later if we need it. Ah, oh, it's starting to get dark again, too. That's no good. Get out. Ladders again. Put my tree tap away. And this is high enough for now. do is just put up some ladders, and there we go. Now you're probably thinking to yourself, what the hell is Basta doing? Well, here's what I'm going to do. So, at various heights, first height being right here, we put up like a little ring. Partially as, as like a little safety ring, but also, so you can put that up, we're going to put up a row of solar panels. So I'm actually just going to make this row go out. I only have one solar panel for now, and so that's obviously not ideal. But, uh, well actually I didn't even have the solar panel. So let's go down, whoop, build the solar panel from the materials that I put in this chest. Some coal, all that good stuff. Actually, let me empty the crap out of my inventory. I know some, some of you guys have let me know how pleased you are with the fact that I clean out my inventory. Uh, I guess it kind of bugs me when I see people that have really sloppy inventories and 
is. They don't do anything about it. I try to have a, a good reason if I'm going to have a sloppy inventory, and so, you know, might as well, might as well just go along with it. So we put a generator in the middle there, and then I'm pretty sure it's coal dust, coal dust, coal dust, glass, glass, glass. If not, I got this backwards. Yeah, there we go. So we got a solar panel. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the solar panel <coughs> and I'm just going to put it on the end there. And then as, as we generate power, um, whoops, we're going to pipe it down along this little row here. So it's going to come down, 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 and it's going to go into the bat box. And so, this bat box probably isn't getting a whole lot of power. Uh, mostly because it's nighttime right now. And so this solar panel isn't generating a goddamn thing. Uh, we can also look up windmills. Uh, that'll be our next goal. Windmills. Let's look up... Oh, goddamn it. That's just a generator with four iron ingots. But it generates, from what I understand, less power. So that's obviously not good. The other thing that I'm going to want to do is I'm going to dig out a little trench underneath everything because we want to connect up the wiring. We're, speaking of wiring, we need more wires. That's going to be a priority. And also, the wires that we're using are just copper. Uh, and copper wires aren't really efficient at all. So eventually we're gonna we're gonna want to upgrade, and upgrading our wires is gonna take a decent amount of effort. For now, in order to upgrade our wires, I don't think I have any copper smelted as of right now. Well, we need some more stuff as of right now. We need an electric electric furnace. So the recipe for an electric furnace is an electronic circuit, an iron furnace, and some redstone. Fortunately, to make the iron furnace, or to make the, the wire, we need to um, we need to make some... Oh, I don't have a whole lot of stuff, do I? We need to make some copper, copper ingots. For now, though, this bat box uh, is going to be pretty sufficient. I'm going to borrow this battery. We've got enough tin dust to last us for a while. Uh, we've got a significant amount of rubber, so we could stop working on that. I'm just going to put this in here, in there. So once this is made a third one, we can make our first round of electric cable. That'll make a circuit. Oh, look at how good that is. Some copper wire. Uh, we have one reinforced iron, or refined iron rather, and that's the exact amount that we need. That's our last one. And what's the recipe for this? Circuit, furnace, and then two redstone. I saw something go past the window out there. Did you see that? Oh, there he is. Oh, they, they freak me out. Oh, we need a generator, right? Oh, crap. No, an iron furnace. An iron furnace. I need more iron. <laughs> We've got iron dust. We can start smelting the iron dust into... Uh, how many do we need? Three, four. We need four more to make eight for eight iron. And then we should be good. In the meantime, I'm just going to take a minute to dig the rest of this out. Just this is where we're gonna lay our copper cable. We're gonna need a lot of copper cable. Uh, fortunately though we're gonna be able to run our electric furnace off of batteries. 
So we're not going to need a whole lot of power at first. So we can kind of just figure it out as we go along. So we need an iron furnace, a circuit board, and then we need two redstone. That's going to give us an electric furnace. What this does is it lets us... I'm going to pop it down right here. For the record, I'm probably going to rearrange a lot of stuff going forward, but that's fine. Here's our macerator. I'm going to take this tin out. I'm going to put some of that copper in, and I know I filled up a battery. So we're going to start macerating some of this copper, because we're going to need more copper. And then I'm going to take the dead battery out of here, put it in the bat box to get recharged. And so our end goal is to start refining some stuff really fast. That's, that's our end goal. So, oh, this, this isn't going to be ideal, is it? I'm actually going to break this bottom one, because we're going to do something right here. And you guys are just going to be absolutely amazed at, at what I'm going to do. I have to figure out how to make pipe first. So let's go in here and look at how to make pipe. Oh, there's so many pipes. We just want some basic ones, though. We just want stone transport pipe. And the recipe for it is just two stone and some glass in the middle. Or we can do cobblestone, I believe. I believe there's some cobblestone. Do cobblestone. Yeah, cobblestone transport pipe. It's the same thing, but with cobblestone. And we're cheap. Uh, and we don't, we don't really have a whole lot of glass, so we're just going to make a few of them. So, just pop down a few. That's a lot. You get a lot of pipe. And then also we're going to do it with some wood. We don't need a whole lot of these. We're going to get eight out of the deal, which is still more than we need. Plenty of pipe. So I'm going to set down a wooden pipe there and our cobblestone pipe there. And what the hell is this going to do? Well, not much at first, but we need an engine now. And an engine basically gives power to things from the redstone mod. So we're going to need a redstone engine, and the recipe for this is some wood, glass, wooden gears, and a piston. Pistons are easy enough to make. Do I have enough iron for it? No. So, uh, here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to... I'm going to start smelting some of this good stuff. Um, once I get everything sorted out, I'll be back with you. Alright, see you soon. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, after much fiddling, I realized I needed a wrench. So I made a wrench. It turns out it was the wrong kind of wrench. There's three different kinds of wrenches. Um, so I made a different kind of wrench. That turned out to be the wrong kind of wrench. Finally, the one that required this, the most resources was the, was the one I needed. And basically what it does is it lets you change what direction electricity comes out of a bat box from. So I wired up uh, my bat box appropriately. Um, got all these useless wrenches now. That's alright. Um, just going to fill in this hole. And so now if you look in here, the extractor is extracting. The macerator is macerating and the electric furnace is electrating. Now, we know that it's getting dark, and we know that the solar power panel is going to stop pumping out electricity. And this is out of wood, and so it's kind of powering down. Um, this is kind of going steady, but soon enough, the solar panel is going to be running out. So we need some way to start you know, making the generator work for us, instead of us working for the generator. So what we're going to do is we're going to create this redstone engine. Uh, this will be the last thing we're going to do today. Uh, we need some redstone, obviously, for a redstone engine. Um, where did I put it? Put it up here. Oh, here we go. We need one of those. We need some iron. We need some cobblestone. So, oh, I'm out of cobblestone. How am I out of cobblestone? Oh. Twelve cobblestone left. Fantastic. And wood along the top. And a piece of iron and a piece of redstone. There we go. So we have that. We need two wooden gears. Two wooden gears. Happen to have those handy. 
Uh, let's, oh, let's look up Redstone Engine again. So the Redstone Engine's recipe calls for a piece of glass. We have some glass, so all we're going to do is we're just going to plonk that down there. Plonk those down there. Some of those along the top and a piece of glass in the middle. And you're saying, Basta? Come on. What's this really going to do? And so you, you're going to see. You're going to be really surprised at, at how well this works. So I'm just going to get rid of this piece of fence here and put in, I guess, a piece of wood. A piece of wood would be fine. And you're saying, that, that just looks like some ridiculous contraption. It's not going to do anything. You know, the sun's, the sun's out, uh, the, the moon's out, this bat box is slowly running out of power. You know, soon enough you're going to be screwed. I'm going to plonk this up here, and this guy is going to start moving. What he's going to do is he's going to tell this wooden pipe uh, to start sucking things out. So when that guy's powered, he basically makes these guys, uh, these pipes, do things, uh, or other redstone power uh, bits. Wooden pipes will suck things out. Cobblestone pipes are just regular pipes, um, as are stone pipes. The, the reason why there's two different kinds is so that uh, you can have them side by side and they won't connect to each other. And then that's pumping it directly into this generator. Now the problem is it's going into the top and not the bottom. Um, not a good thing. Uh, I wonder how you change that. Oh shit. Oh god. I just broke it. Um, Alright. But that's that's unimportant. Um, I'll, I'll fix that up in my spare time. God, is that a zombie out there? Oh man. This, this whole world is terrifying. Everything here is, is just trying to kill me. And I'm I'm just trying to run a legitimate mining corporation um, undisturbed by my surroundings. And all I get is hate. I don't get any... Nothing seems to go my way when it comes to... Um, oh. When it comes to doing things. Oh, is that a cow? Yeah, it's a cow. But... Yeah, I thank you for joining me uh, this time. I hope you learned something, uh, and I hope I wowed you a little bit. Um, I'm going to try and get this working better uh, for next time. I'll show it to you if I do. And uh, thanks for joining me. Uh, I've been Matt, and if, if you like this video, remember to like it. And if, if you aren't subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Uh, I could use, I could use the, the viewer count, the viewership. Uh, boosts my ego and it tells me, hey, there's people out there that would love to watch your videos. Thanks. Have a good night.